anyway that's it guys it's it's pretty easy to do and when you plug it into your iPod it's going to tell you it doesn't recognize the hardware so just dismiss that window it's it's okay all right now anybody want to see an old man this is the old man okay now on the other side you can see at the top there's the LED on the left side there's a crystal uh, oscillator on both sides of the jack the line out where is it the line out jack or line in jack line in jack uh, this is a microprocessor IC that communicates with the iPod through the dock connector and right there is the microphone there is another version of this that I have seen where R24 isn't right there it's down that way a little more but the same principle applies remove R24 whichever side of the R24 that's connected to pin 1 of that IC right there that little bitty one pin 1 of that little bitty IC is what we need to take up to 3.3 volts right there right there is a good spot and again that's let me see if I can get closer that's the left end of oh C16 see the label there C16 now the left side of that is 3 volts 3.3 volts so just take it from there over to the end of R24 that you remove the end that's connected to pin 1 of that little bitty IC okay I'll, when my daughter gets home I'll have her help me make a better production this is I'm not real good at this guys but I'm learning so anyway hopefully we can get a software uh, fix to turn that IC on I'm sure it's doable I just haven't discovered it yet see you guys later bye